shopping sites. Customers are often provided with product catalogs which provide the user with image of the product, description, price, rating by customers or staff, popularity, product code, number in stock. The products are usually grouped in subcategories which appear in submenus. Customers can add products to a basket or bag and pay for everything in a checkout page once they are done shopping. If a customer does not have an account, they may be able to shop as a guest or be asked to create an account. Online shopping sites often have secure payment systems. Booking systems Customers can book train tickets, airline tickets and bus tickets online and will be allowed to choose how many tickets they want travel times, and the type of ticket. Ticket can be sent through an email provided as an e-ticket or a scannable QR code. Banks Online banking services allow customers to check balances, set balance alerts, make payments and transfers, apply for loans, manage alerts, and change personal information. Gaming Gaming sites allow people from all over the world to play games hosted on a remote server. A multiplayer game would mean that players control different characters and can see what other players are doing in the game. Benefits of online goods and services Online goods and services provide the time needed for people to do other important things. Online grocery shopping Easily reorder same products as last time, do not have to travel to the supermarket, can check items in stock without having to walk around. Online booking systems, do not have to travel to the station to buy tickets, avoid queues, can buy tickets early, can be notified of delays. Online banking, do not have to travel to the bank, avoid carrying cash. Online learning, do not have to travel to colleges, avoid moving closer to school. Online information, receive weather alerts and traffic advice, be rerouted automatically. Drawbacks Immediate availability of online services could make people more demanding and less patient. People become more isolated and detached from the real world and detached from others' needs. People might spend more time online than face to face with others, which might reduce communication skills and there is less need to memorize thanks to online services, so people's memory may be affected. Transactional data Transactional data is data that is sent between digital devices. This data can be tracked online and is stored in cookies. Cookies can be encrypted when they are transferred. The data that can be stored in cookies can be time and date of transaction, IP address, referring website, products or service previously bought, items added to shopping baskets, data entered into web forms or many other forms of data. There are three main types of cookies. Session cookies, only stored until the web page is closed. Persistent cookies, record information over time, can be used to keep someone logged in or for advertisers to track users' internet usage. Third-party cookies can be used to personalize user experience or send targeted advertisements.